Are we back? I don't know what is happening here. Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing, James. Like, everything, like, even Twitch Studio is messing up now. It says, it, like, it thinks I'm live, and then it thinks I'm not, and then it says other things, I don't know. It, it, it told me I was live, no, it told me I wasn't live when I was, and then told me I was when I wasn't. So, everything's messing up here, right. I'm checking your DMs now, SP, so. I need to... Right, okay, where are you seeing that button exactly? Uh, what the heck? Oh, it's at the bottom of the screen. Selecting event. What? Oh, it's there. So you want me to put this up? I first put on GND. What? Let me do that down. Okay, yeah, that's fine. So that's down, that's good. Put on GND. What is GND? Okay. This. I have to put. Oh no, sorry. I see what you mean, yeah, yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. Can I just, can I just, um. Am I okay to take off the ground power? Because I want to start the pushback already. Can I take off ground power without the whole thing cutting off? Oh, fuck off, S Reed. Not yet, okay. Now APU is on because you have EGT. Fuck ground off. Yes! Yeah, fuck off, ground! Right, let's get out of way. Just piss off power. Right, okay, good. We got that. We got rid of that bastard at last. So... I'll get the pushback target here anyway. Pre-plan pushback. Uh, how do I? No, no, no. Oh God. Yeah, click. Yeah, please. Click and drag to move around. Click to place it. Was backspace to move last set waypoint. Yeah, sorry, I know that I'm just completely, you know, not even paying attention. I just want to face that way. And what does that say? Press enter to accept the plan route. Okay, um... If APU gen is extinguished, not lit, we are drawing power from it. Okay, so that... Uh, there's nothing on that, so that means it's extinguished, and that means we're drawing power from it. Oh, 
Okay, good, right, we're getting somewhere. Let me just move that up to the other side so the Twitch thing doesn't get in the way of it. Yeah, well, I think, yeah, I don't really want to be doing that, James. I think it's, I think that's your job. Wait, hang on, did Sparky raid me? Oh, God, I didn't even notice. That's how broken this bloody app is. I didn't even realise Sparky raided me. Well, sorry about that, if you're watching the vlog back, because I didn't even notice. But thank you for the raid. Much appreciated. And blame Twitch Studio for not showing me that you did. If you have EGT... Uh, we have APU running. Oh yeah, and that's definitely running. So that's that's not not that's on more than zero. So the APU is running. Right, I'm gonna start. Is that? Do I have to? Um, are they ready to push me back? I can't even tell, can I? I I haven't even requested bloody thing yet. Cockpit to ground. This is ground. Stand by. God, that sounds like a Terminator. Sounds like a ter not the Terminator, but like a ter never mind. Typical Ryanair flight, like, yeah, it doesn't get off the ground for ages. But we're not actually late. You can see at the bottom of the screen, we still have 20 minutes to we meant to take off, so we're not late yet. Turn left engine GND off, you won't have enough power okay, otherwise. Bypass pin is installed. All doors and hatches closed and all ground equipment is removed. Please set parking brakes. Oh, just wait a minute, mate. I need to know how to turn on the engines. And I also need to fiddle around with all the lights as well. Please set parking brakes. Shut it! Now look at the centre screen. I'm guessing you want me to play with those knobs there. Oh, that's... sorry, there. Still done something wrong. Oh god. Well, that seems to be a good start. What happens if I? Let me just let me just get the pushback going because we know the APU is working. So yeah, let's just release the parking, parking brake. Set. You may lift. Parking brake set. Lifting the aircraft. Put up the fuel lever now. Okay. Well, I will when this guy starts moving. We are cleared for starting. Yeah, that's great. Now get on with it. Parking brakes are released. Yes, I know. I just said that. Push back. You can start the engines in sequence. It will start in the sequence. Right. Okay. Let's do that then. See that says engine fail. Start valve open. Is that? Oh God! What's it doing with the view now? So that's ground, I'm guessing. APU bleed. Well, it's on. I think. Must be. Unless what's that? Packs off. What the fuck does that mean? Place it firmly over your nose and mouth. Secure the elastic band behind your head. Tighten the straps if necessary, and breathe normally. 
Although the bag does not inflate, oxygen is flowing to the mask. If you're traveling with a child or someone who requires assistance, secure your mask okay, on first completed. and then Please your parking brake. Keep your mask on until a member of the crew advises you it is safe to remove it. Oh, that window, window was in the way. Uh. Shut. I did set the bloody parking brake, mate. Yes, parking brake. Yeah, but now the parking brake isn't set. Oh, I don't even know. I don't care. Um, L and right pack off. Uh, is it not already off? Oh no, that. No, that's no, no, no. That's a fan. This is the. Oh right, no, it can go off. Sorry. Thank you and goodbye. Needs en needs energy because it's a weak ass Boeing. Oh, that sounds promising now. Yep, that it, that the error's gone and that's spalling up. Yes, here we go. Here we go. Right, let's do the um. Typical hydraulics checks that they would do at this point. Hang on, is that those buttons working? Oh yeah, that is working. And what about my sp uh, speed brakes? Yep, yeah, judging by that sound, that's probably. Well, actually, is it working? Oh, what's going on with the bloody speed brakes? Oh, whatever, we don't need them yet. Alright, let's get, uh, so... One more thing I need to know, airspeed. Does that stand... Oh, it's already gone off. Oh, never mind then. I don't even need to faff around. Right, let's get that on ground. And get the fuel lever for that open. That goes on C O N T for takeoff in most SOPs until 10,000. I'm guessing it means uh, 10,000 feet. We're ready for departure. Okay, right, so let's just get some uh, flaps. Um, where's the thing that tells me what the flaps are on? Must have one, surely. What? What? Oh, don't put that up, God. This doesn't seem to be... Sometimes the button doesn't work. Alright, yeah, just put it on the first step, that's what I want. Right, now I've got to find out where the hell we got a taxi to on this mess. Uh, let me just turn off the dome lights, you're not meant to have that on now. Uh, where's the... Yeah, turn that off. Ah, oh, you've sent me the thing for the flaps. Uh... Oh yeah, perfect, thank you very much. Ah, uh, where's the... Uh... The um, auto brakes or the whatever they're called. Oh, it's there. I think. Oh yeah, it is that. Okay, we we'll put we have to put that on max when you taxi. I'm pretty sure. Okay, and then um, let's just see. So we are there. We want to head down. Oh Christ. I mean, if I just have that, like, on my other monitor, I can keep track of it and see where...
we are. I know you can't see it, but you don't need to know that. You don't need. You just need to trust that I know where we're going. We're actually getting somewhere. Put packs on. Okay. What? Back on auto? Yeah. Yes, we're actually moving, Prof. It's madness. APU bleed off. I'll do that when I finish this turn. APU bleed, okay. Uh, that there, turn that off. If I can, yep, yeah, turn that off. And for them as well? No, probably not for the engine. Oh god, have I just fucked it up? No, I think it's fine. Yeah, engine bleed stays on, I thought so. Uh, let me just check your DMs. Uh, you see Gen 1 Gen 2, put them down to the two blue lights, extinguish. This? Put them down, you say? Oh yeah, there you go. Then fuck APU off, what, that there? Oh Christ. Then below APU off. What do you mean? Like, where's. Because like, there's so many APU buttons, I don't know which is the right one to actually press. Is it that one? I think it might be that one, yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. Let's turn that off then. And I believe the runway is just going to be on our right here shortly. Uh, okay, yeah, a little bit to go yet. Oh god, I've just hidden the overload, that's not what I wanted to do, how do I... There we go. Oh bloody hell mate, madman. Um, the only thing I'm going to need help with next when we take off is the uh, LNAV and VNAV. I think I want to use LNAV, don't I? I can't remember, for the autopilot. Because with Airbus it's much easier because there's just one button for the autopilot, but with this it's LNAV, VNAV, all sorts of stuff. Both, okay. Because I know, I think VNAV is vertical navigation, isn't it? If I remember correctly. Right then. They can be turned on now, let's do that then. Um, are you sure about that? Oh yeah, flight director, did I? So LNAV's on. What about VNAV? Uh, 
Uh, let me just get the landing lights on as well. And any other lights? Oh yeah, strobe. I need to just get over there. I can't see it from here. Uh, uh, apparently I turned that on too early. In FMC. What's in the FMC? Legs page. Oh yeah, I should probably check that first actually. Seems to be all good. Reserves need to be put at like one there. Uh, what here? Oh, I couldn't find it in SimB. It's not that important. And there it is. Okay, perfect. Right then. I think that should be everything. Flaps are done yet. Uh, TCAS. There's no AI, but we may as well do it for realism's sake. Uh, oh, God. I mean, why am I twisting my head? I can literally just do it here. Uh, this is not like it is on the Airbus, obviously. Ah, there. It, that's TCAS there. Yeah, Tara it needs to be on. And... Uh, can we lock the door? Is that something they've got on this? I've got no idea. I also don't care. I'm going to stop delaying this. Let's just get going. We'll go for a rolling takeoff. Here we go, first take off in the um, seven of these. Well, try not to, James. Try not to. Well, I'll try not to. Right. About 40% power. One, two, stable. Sixty knots, eighty knots. I didn't do the V speeds, but who the hell cares? One hundred forty is good. Rotate. Positive rate gear up. Right, so now, when does... Right, is, I'm, I'm still flying the plane. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm still flying the plane. So when does autopilot take over? Well, I thought I already did. Like, where's the bloody on switch? Oh my god, why is it... Bloody hell. Yep, yeah, okay, so I'm slightly off course. Alright, there we go. Uh, we are going too fast. Can I do the speed manually? Is that allowed? No? Put out up to cruise, yeah. 37,000 feet.
Come on, Dublin. then perfect so we'll just uh, sit back relax and um, hope for the best uh, we can turn off some lights though uh, we can turn off the uh, runway turn off and taxi lights We should do like a race prof so you can like you, you do it you do a like this is this this flight's meant to take us just about an hour so if you do like a route that's meant to take you about an hour it'd be interesting to see i mean yours is probably going to be safer all right there's ten thousand feet so then we'll turn off the uh, landing lights Wing lights off. Logo lights off. Seat belt? No, not yet. I, I always do. I always do the seat belt signs at the top of ascend. When we get to cruising altitude, I don't do it at ten thousand feet. I just want to get a bit more vertical. I just want to, you know. Do this a bit quicker. Yeah, everyone get pissed on the plane. Start selling overpriced alcohol. Everything seems to be going quite well so far, surprisingly. We can uh, turn off the auto brake now, don't need that on. <laughs> Whoa, we're going to Ibiza, back to the island. Well, not quite airspeed. We're going somewhere a bit less exciting, Gatwick. And I will do a um, A320 flight another day, maybe in the charity stream, just so I can prove to you that I can actually fly an Airbus without having to ask for chat's instructions constantly. I can fly an A320. So I just need to get a bit more used to the Boeing side of things. Two quid for a sandwich, ten pound G and E R. Honestly, say anything else. Uh, stuck with the DMs are open for me. Have a passion, of course it is. And um, yeah, I'm probably gonna <laughs> um, take you up on that offer many times in the future. 
So thank you very much for that. Yeah, I was going to say, um, I know that, um, this is a, this should be in HPA. It's just the fact that I couldn't find a switch to do it, but yeah, thanks for pointing that out. I know that, uh, the, like, the US use inches and stuff. Yeah, HPA for the win, definitely. How funny would it be if the plane crashed because of a bug in with you know with the plane and not not because of my flying errors? That would be interesting. In fact, that's a good excuse if something goes wrong. Yeah, well, you know, it was the you know it just, the plane's just released. It's just a bug, isn't it? Not my fault. Right, so, uh, wait, is that the map? Yeah, there's the map. So, uh, we are over the water, about to go over Wales. So, uh, everyone wave to Jim as we go over Wales. Uh, once again, that's in the complete one corner because that thing's in the way, so I'll move it there. <laughs> Fuck you, Jim. Yeah, just just like throw shit out the window or something. Yeah, just someone conveniently use the toilet as we're going over Wales. What is this a Mark III coach? What, do, do the Mark III's actually dump the shit on the tracks? Is that what... Well, some, I can imagine they don't anymore, the refurbished Mark III's. Used to, yeah. <laughs> I'd hope they have tanks. Oh, God. If you've ever been in a like a 158 tournament and seen a sign saying not to flush in the station, that's why. I don't think I've ever seen the sign on. I don't, well, I don't think I've ever used the toilet on a train that's not got a tank. Maybe I might have not been looking out for it, but I don't recall seeing one of them. Yeah, probably a bit too young. Sit stand. I like controlling the speed manually, it's just something I just like to do. And especially, with, like, sometimes I can't, I, I like fail to program the speed properly in the FMC or just forget or can't be bothered, and then it can, you know, really screw up the descent if it's trying to keep a certain speed that's too fast. I just prefer to do it manually. 
Oh, there's someone else ripping up their contract. Not for DTG this time, though. Oh, it's probably someone ripping up the, the drinks menu back there, actually, after they've seen the fucking prizes for it. I think anyone... Yeah, that's what I thought the refurbished ones must do. I was thinking about the um, the cow from yesterday. I, I left a comment on the um, ATS scenario thing. I don't, don't know if they've. I checked it earlier while they hadn't applied. I'm going to see if they've applied to it now. Oh, my scenario has been uploaded on ATS now as well. We're really getting quite slow here. Nope, still haven't replied. What I might have to do is download another one of their scenarios and see if there's a cow in any of the other ones. Back to BR sandwiches. Preparation of sandwiches. Oh god. Look at that. The, that that's brilliant, actually. Like a tutorial in the in the BR style, BR like menu style. Right, we are officially over Wales now, so, um, either wave or shit on G, whatever you prefer to do. We're going to need to start descending soon. So let's get the charts up for Gatwick. Oh, what are you bitching about? Yeah, I know we're getting a bit s s slow, whatever, just calm down. We're literally at cruising altitude any second now anyways, we'll level off. Do Ethiopians, I mean, let's get a little what? Lightning maps. God, it's barely... well... A bit near Ebb Street. Uh, anyway, yeah, I was looking at the charts before I was distracted. But we're at, we're, we're at cruising altitude, so we'll take the seatbelt sign off for approximately five minutes before we have to start descending again. Oh God, hang on. Was it? Oh, oh I turned it off. It was actually. Oh well, that was okay. It's been off the whole time, but this is not. 
Pretend that pretend that wasn't the case. Pilot sleeping. Oh god, Ethiopian here. Oh right, okay. Yeah, let's just have a kip. Yeah, that's the one. In a few moments, we'll be starting our in-flight service. We will be serving complimentary drinks and snacks. Please look in your feedback for our list of complimentary and premium drinks. Premium drinks are available for a small charge. Please note that we only accept credit cards. Alright, so let me check this. So we need to be at flight level 200 by this it and then 150 by that one 0 70 by that one okay yeah that was the biggest flash you've ever seen in your life it was like God let one go. God, is it really, where, where is it really that bad? What sort of area? Are you 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 in like um I don't know. You you are you in London still, or are you um further down south? If you don't mind saying that is of course. Right, let's start playing with the FMC then. I've got to start faffing around with the approach stuff or something. Um, descent. Yeah, I, was, I did see that, but I mean, honestly, I didn't really pay much attention to it. It just it looks, like, looks like a load of dots. It's like a connect the dots puzzle. So it's every dot a lightning strike. God, how the hell do they know exactly where it hit? Well, if it wants to keep going further west, then that's fine. Oh, crap. No, I don't want to do that. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. So, how would I... Um, like, program the ILS on this. Like, when I say that, I mean, how would I enter all the, like, the, the um, decision height and the, the weather information and the transition altitude and the, um, ILS DME, all that. Where, which page is that? I don't really need to use ILS, I just kind of want to have it in case visibility is low. Okay, wait, wait, which one did I need to be at that high by? Uh, no, not that one, this one. Oh, this here, okay. Well then... You don't put weather in, but do you know what? That seems that seems kind of stupid. But yeah, they are definitely inferior. Oh, there's this. Yeah. Oh, oh no! Look, it actually says on there, flight level two zero zero. That's nice.
Right, they're nearly done. So we're not, this is this is not going to take us another hour, by the way. It's going to take us about half an hour max. But yeah, they're nearly done serving snacks and drinks, so I'll probably like start descending shortly after they're done. But I'll have to do a, a flight in the day as well, just so we can properly see the exterior and everything. Minimums will be there. Oh yeah, mins. Oh yeah, there. Although I'm not really sure how to use it, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so if I zoom this in a bit here now, um Yeah, okay, we can see it there. Are they done? Okay, they're done serving their snacks. We are nearly uh, about to go over Birmingham, so I'd advise you to not look out the window. Take a dump on Ryan, oh god. We're just taking dump, we're just gonna, uh, yeah, we're just gonna tour around the whole country and take dumps on all of our community. Just done Jim, we could have probably done David if we had, you know, flying, flo flown up here just a little bit more. We'll do Ryan here, we'll go down here and do James. Prof, I don't know where Prof's around, like, Prof's around here somewhere. Uh. Airspeed, you're like, I don't know, according to your lightning, you're around here somewhere. London City is you, yeah, so you're just gonna be just there. Somewhere around there. Who else have we got? Eggers Box, I have no idea, but we'll just assume London because he's district line driver, so probably around there somewhere. Um, who else? Jess, I've no idea where Jess is. Not even roughly, I don't even know roughly where she is, so not a clue there. <laughs> what about you, fucking Skegness, judging by your language, Skegness? No, I'm, I'm uh, down here in uh, Surrey. Uh, EGGW, no that's Luton, that's not Surrey. My closest airport is Farnborough, EGLF. Um, not quite, well I obviously get the trains to Hersham all the time but, um, I'm a bit more. I want. I want. My local station is on the Alton branch. Uh, 
Okay, let's get the seatbelts on. And let's start the descent. To 20,000 feet. Shut it. Get rid of that now. And then we want vertical speed. Oh Christ. About 1,500. tell exactly how long I'm gonna oh actually yeah we're gonna need to descend faster I think let me just check my controls here because I'm sure that my that should be doing the speed brakes spoilers whatever extend spoilers yet yeah. retract so why the bloody hell is it not doing it then What is going on with this? Retard. Oh, it's fine anyway. Oh, good. Now I can't get the bloody things to go back down. Oh, God. Now I want it to sort of be half. I need to descend quicker than this as well. Right, what is it? Okay, let me just see. Is that that's doing the job? Break free. Yeah, but Google Translate is a bit weird when it comes to English and French. Sometimes it's not, this. it does it weirdly or there's more than one different way of saying it. I'm quickly coming to the realisation that we are not descending quick enough here. See bug all from that view as you'd expect. Oh, 
god, this, that's, that's how long it's going to take us to descend. We need to slow the hell down here. And I would, but this fucking... Oh my god. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, yeah, there is a lot of lightning around Cambridge. <laughs> Alright, so what do we have to be at by the next one? At Kidley we have to be at flight level 150, well we may as well... do that now. And then we'll do this so it lines up. Not that far. Perfect. Right, so we can probably see he throw at some point. And we're going to probably need to speed up a little bit when we get to um, this waypoint. And what about next? Uh, we need to be at flight level 070 for Willow. Welcome in, little sinker. Thanks for tuning in. How are you doing? Shut it.
swiveling daddy are you? Very good. Uh, so I'm guessing you two know each other then. Well, obviously. Thank you very much for the follow, Lil Sinker. Much appreciated. Or well, Dave, as I'm pretty sure your name is. What is going on with the alert? It's playing like 20 times. Uh, yeah, he's a TS streamer too, like Darko, but don't change his name every two weeks, fair enough. Well, thank you again for the follow, we're just uh, on the approach into Gatwick in the new PMDG 737-800 series. Dave plays Flight Sim 2. Night Prof, no problem, thanks for tuning in and I have a great night's sleep. Wish us luck for the landing, hopefully it won't be a mess. Can't see bugger all out the windows. <laughs> Dipping out before death, exactly. Geordie and put it in like a javelin, yeah, or we could actually try and land it properly. Imagine that though, just just fly it in the runway like a bloody dart or javelin. I mean, with Concorde that'll work quite well considering it is basically just a big dart. With this, I'm not so sure. If you did it with Concorde, its nose would probably stick in the ground. With Ryanair, so why not? Because Ryanair is safe. <laughs> They're a very safe airline. I think we've only ever had one major incident before. What the hell happened to the map? Oh, he throws to the left, but it's far too far to actually see it. So is British Airways and easy, but they fly master Airbus planes. Yeah, which is kind of more of a compliment to Ryanair, considering they can still be safe in 737s, which are just inferior.
Yeah, we do love to hate Ryanair. Everyone loves to hate Ryanair, but that is true. Although the downside with the cheap fares is you have to pay for everything else, which is such things, such as things that you would just get for free on other airlines, included with the price. So it's not really much cheaper, but kind of is if you want to do it really skintly or tightly. <laughs> skintly, even a word? No idea. It's too late to be got to be pondering on that. <laughs> Take it quicks. Yeah, we'll get we'll get one at Gatwick. You dragged the vertical stab my extra down the runway, it inverted, not crashed. Well, you must have some serious skill then. Either that or some serious luck. Or either that or you had the crash settings turned off, one or the other. Right, 10,000 feet, so I have to slow down to 240 knots here. And we'll get the uh, landing lights on. Uh, wing lights on, logo lights on, anti-collision stay on, obviously. Um, what on earth? He plays flight sim on an RC, even a laugh. God, a Bennett. I'd like, I'd pay to watch that. Right, I'm just a little confused about what's going on there. We have begun our final descent into London. Like, why is there some random candy cane? And how do I get rid of it? Please complete all Wi-Fi related tasks and stow any larger electronics. Maybe if I just... Oh god. Uh, and then delete that D144 thing. Just get lost, mate. Yeah, that. Execute. Execute. And then the next one is just me. Perfect. RC stuff. Do you know that's actually interesting because I've wanted to. I've, I keep seeing all these videos of like RC planes, you know, with, with their airships. It looks so damn cool. I really want to get good at flying one, but I know I'm terrible and it will just be such a waste of money. Just crash everything all the time. Right, um, we need to be. Uh, Oh, I know what that flight, I know what that willow thing was there for. Oh, it doesn't matter, I've got rid of it now. It was that weird approach that James did when he landed at Gatwick the other day, remember? That, like, S-bend approach. So yeah, 4,000 there. I 
Oh damn, that did shoot off. Why the hell does it make so much difference? It's frozen here. I think it should. I think it's just having a moment. Yeah, there we go. It often does that on the approach to Gatwick. Coke addiction is much cheaper than flights. Well. Yeah, I guess true. Actually, so, depends if you want to get in the into the add-ons. Yeah, this thing really can't make up its mind on when we're going to finish the descent. So Gatwick's just to the left down there. Oh, come on, game, sort yourself out. Shush. What is that noise? Are we in a thunderstorm? Someone check the lightning radar or whatever it's called just to see if there's a thunderstorm around Gatwick area right now. Because this is using live weather. There is a thunderstorm here. Charming. Great. Well, that's going to make for an interesting situation. Oh, yeah, there is as well. I slow down to 220 knots. Right, let's start slowing down, I mean, slowing down, descending to 4,000. Oh, piss. I hope I didn't press anything important then.
Oh yeah, we can see the uh, ground there. Good view from here. Still no sign of the airport. God, well, I've really enjoyed this so far. So I'm just fearing what's going to happen with this reverse thruster when we land, and also the fact the spoilers I haven't really got working either. So that's two big, you know, things that slow me down. I'm having issues with. Six knots, that's not that bad, is it? Then again, it depends the direction it's blowing. It's heading 290. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, look at you getting all disappointed. It out, zoom out every time, so annoying. Get some flaps in, in a second, that is. Um, because I'm fearful we're not going to get any reverse thrust, I'm going to put the and the auto brakes up to about two. I know I would normally have it on one, but I'm just felt worried about the reverse thrust. Let's get some flaps. Visibility doesn't seem great though, does it? Because anyway, I still can't see the damn airport.
Oh, what are you whinging about? Fuck it, yeah, can that noise shut up? Flaps and no gear. Gear down. Okay, I'll do it when we line up. Oh, bug. I'll just do it now because that noise is really annoying. Oh, no, it's still not. Just wait for it to go green. Get those lights on now. Get down to three green. Yeah, and that noise still hasn't stopped yet. Oh, well, there we go. The visibility is terrible, though, so I am going to have some landing challenge. I don't be too disappointed. Toggle approach mode. Is everything set up where it will just glide down on the ILS? Alright, well, I'll do that when we line up with the runway then. Oh, hang on. Okay, I can see the runway. Thank God for that. Right, how can we arm this just... And then, how do you arm it? Yeah, set spoilers armed. Oh, I had it then. There. Oh, I don't fucking know. Fuck it. Oh, there's the pink diamond. Okay, good. I, I should have. I shouldn't have pressed. That. I should press that when it lines up or whatever. No, not fifty percent. This bloody thing. Oh, I need a PMDG. So, oh, there we go. I think that's done it. Right. So, hopefully, this will glide down with the um, pink diamond. If not, I'll be a bit concerned. Oh, it looks like it's pitching down. Yes. Perfect. Right, now I need to turn this light off. Uh, where's the light on this? Where's the lights? Yeah, I need that only does okay, it's gonna get laggy because we're getting near Gatwick. Floodlight brightness can go down. Oh, you know what? I should probably pay attention to the runway now. This is good lighting. Bloody hell, this is some steep approach angle. Yep, can't see bugger all with that view. Right, that's 1000, disengage the autopilot when I could reach over for the button. Shit. Yes, I'm very aware. Calm down, calm down. Can that fuck shut the fuck up? Oh, can that bloody noise shut up.
That noise is so annoying. I, I, I'm not going to fiddle around with any buttons trying to turn it off. I'm just going to concentrate on the landing. Come on, game. Hold yourself together. I don't know why there's so many bloody trains down there at this time in the morning. It's so annoying trying to do it when it's stuttering like this. You have no idea. Come on, don't float. Get down, you bastard. Get down. I'm just going to slam it down. Okay, right, we're gonna stop in time, thank Christ, but that noise is still really annoying me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to London Gatwick. The local time is 4.46 a.m. and it's currently about 90 degrees Celsius. You can now use your mobile device. <laughs> did, did you just say it was 90 degrees Celsius? Surely not. Right, I need to sort that out. Oh, all I needed to do was press that. Are you joking me? Oh my god. Right, let's get this menu, this this chart up. Right, I'm just gonna go to the nearest gate. Fuck this! I, I, I'm not gonna research which gate Ryanair goes to, am I? That was a very eventful landing. APU, oh god, I forgot about that. Let me just get on the runway and we'll sort it out. I'll leave it there and let them walk. I'm tempted to. Yeah, when I, when I get a new PC, this is going to be much better to land because it's so annoying with those FPS stutters. Right, what do I need to do again, airspeed, to, do, to get the APU on? No, they, they don't after that landing, that's for sure. They can't bloody walk. Oh, it's that one, right, okay. Yeah, very true. They're paying for the flight, not to be driven around. In fact, speaking of the lights, let's turn the. Uh, oh, piss. Let's turn off the landing lights, turn off the strobe lights. Oh, honestly, I'm not even bothered about the bloody spoilers. I can stay like that, see if I care. This chose on. Yeah, have a, let's have a rave at 5 a.m.
I have to admit, this does look nice. And also really bloody crisp as well. I've walked over that bridge before, I'm sure many of you have. Yeah, it's turned us into the party plane. Party just because we didn't die on the landing, that sounds like a good enough reason to have a party. And then any any piss and crap that anyone, you know, lets out during the party, we can just fly back over and dump over Jim's house. We can kind of actually see the model properly now. Oh good god, this lag. I'm not even looking in the direction of the airport. I totally didn't put it into 100% power then, not at all. I love how it says on on the bottom left on the packs, it says passengers are 77% 77 happy, they're only, they're only satisfied. Bloody ages taxiing in. Oh, fuck it. There's a gate. I know Ryanair probably don't go to this gate in real life, but I don't care. There's a gate there. That'll do. At least, at least with the light, we can actually get a nice view of the plane model. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be a connecting flight. No, don't stop yet. Oh, fuck it, that'll do. Right, let's turn all these lights off. Um, do we have ground power? Not yet. I need to actually get that over here. Power, jetway, all that malarkey. Or do I need to do the power from their special power?
connecting. Well, is it actually there or is it going to take ages? Oh, oh, it's there, okay. Well, it didn't take ages then, did it? Right, we have ground power so we can turn everything off now. Seat belts, yep. Yeah. Oh, that bloody music again. Oh my god. We can do the dome light now. Uh, that's the wrong button. Let's turn all the fuel pumps off. APU off. Turn all, it, turn all that crap off. Turn it out of ground power. And that's probably everything important. Uh, yeah, I think that's that's mainly everything. Uh, let's let's get a nice outside view of the aircraft quickly then. What I'll do is I'll sl I'll, I'll slow it down so it, we can get like a walk around. I'm gonna increase the FOV. Sorry, decrease the FOV. I should say. Come on, game, hold it together. So that was um, the first flight in the PMDG 737. I really enjoyed that, and I'm definitely going to be playing this a hell lot more. So, um, yeah, thank you to Airspeed for all your help on this one, because I would not have made it this far without you. And, um, it'd be nice to uh, play some other airlines in this as well, like TUI, Jet 2. Maybe some American things, who knows. But uh, that's that. So um, everyone have a great evening. Everyone thank you for watching. Um, it's been a pleasure. Good night all, everyone have a great evening. No problem for the stream, it's my pleasure. And uh, yeah, thoroughly enjoyed it. So, um, yeah, thank you all. And um, take care, have a great night, and um, goodbye.